we identify players from a young age by going to all the competitions like the Grand Como, the Craven Week. We look at a lot of festivals, uh, school rugby. We know what the weight, the size and the skill levels that's required and then uh, we start tracking those guys. The SAS Academy of Sport, we're very privileged to be here. We've been here now for the last three years. I mean, you can just walk over to the, to the fields on the other side. There's a world-class gym here, there's a swimming pool facilities. So everything is here. I've got to ensure that, that our players are fit and strong for the type of game plan that uh, the coaches want to play on the field. All the coaches are talking about intensity and work rate. You know, one of the ways that we, we use to measure that is uh, we've been using the GPS with the junior box. The key is in training is that we want to train the way we play or maybe even train at a higher intensity than what we play our matches and we plan it accordingly in the week. So we've got some good, good data from the GPS that we use to monitor the players to ensure that we're training at the right intensity. We're working here at Stellenbosch Academy of Sport, the junior box, basically training their eyes, the brain and their bodies to make more effective decisions under pressure. And they're currently busy in the Argen program which simulates what they do on the field of play. So we're training all the different skills, handling skills, scanning, seeing space. My name is Litohonolo Jerome Mambane. I work as a team's doctor. This is my second year with the team. We work in a collision environment. It's a common thing to manage these guys for contusions or any sort of sprains that they may come across. One likes to think that as a doctor, I'm very much hands-on. Yes, you're hands-on, but you know you tend to find that our physio does a lot more, a lot more of the work because there's a lot of manual work that's also required. My name is uh, injury management of the players. So we do a proper injury history the guys when they come to camp once a year just to sort out all their injuries uh, and rehabilitation and then we'll also after training we'll come back do some assessments and treatment again. The three things that matters the most is ability to return to action, his attitude in which he carries out his, his duties and the intensity in which he trains and plays. Prepare the box to win is it's very tough work. It takes a complete teamwork from the SA rugby departments and the, the MOBI units the right through to the management of the team. Uh, hopefully you'll get the right combinations together and the right guys that can put their hands up after this World Cup to be counted on to, to take it forward in the future.